Migraines and headaches are becoming more widespread in today's hectic lifestyle. They can be caused by medical issues, but they're more typically the result of stress, dehydration, a late work night, or simply overdoing it in spin class. While there are a variety of headache remedies available, such as over-the-counter ibuprofen, acetaminophen, or prescription headache drugs, they don't always alleviate the symptoms. And as tempting as it may be, taking more than the advised amount is not the solution. In truth, several popular and really basic lifestyle practices can help alleviate headache discomfort without resorting to medication. Anyone who has ever had a splitting headache or migraine episode understands how difficult it is to work, drive, or even hold a conversation when the head is throbbing. When a headache occurs, though you have options other than crawling into bed and hoping it would go away, there are efficient headache cures and strategies to get relief quickly. Pain relief can be achieved by medication and natural treatments. To relieve the pounding, you've probably used a variety of medicines. Analgestic medicines have been accessible to the general public since the late 1800s to relieve general pain, including headache discomfort, Although numerous pharmaceuticals are available to alleviate headache symptoms, there are also a number of effective natural therapies. While this may not always work, it appears to be a lot better than the alternative and bizarre therapies of the past. Here, we have listed five weird ways to cure a headache. Let's get started. Number 5. Trepanning Trepanation is a surgical technique in which a circular portion of bone is taken from the skull during a trephine or trepan, which is a unique saw-like device. Trepanation or trephining is another name for the procedure. The Greek word trepanon, which means auger or drill, is the source of the English term trepan. Trepanation is the earliest surgical operation known to humans. Circular holes as large as 2 inches in diameter have been discovered in the skulls of Cro-Magnon's individuals believed to be 40,000 years old. Trepanation was used by the Incas of Peru as early as 2000 BC. These surgeries were considered to be used to treat persons with mental diseases, epilepsy, and persistent migraine headaches by permitting demons to exit via a hole in the skull. Trepanation, according to Halverson's testimonies, has a number of advantages, including a reduction in the frequency and intensity of chronic headaches, as well as relief from anxiety, sadness, and other mood disorders. Hmm, looks scary. Let us know in the comments what would you do in ancient times to cure a headache, a hole in the skull, or something else. Number 4. Add some eels to the bath. To be honest, electricity and the brain don't get along very well. Nonetheless, electricity and the brain have been intertwined for ages through medicine. An example would be electroshock therapy. In 1762, the Dutch Society of Sciences issued a collection of treatises one of which includes a scenario from South America tooting the virtues of electric eels in relieving head pain. When a slave complains of a terrible headache, he instructs them to place one hand on their head and the other on the fish, and they will be healed quickly. Have you heard that? Without a doubt. Although novel invasive methods for migraine therapy have emerged in recent decades, the use of invasive treatments for this purpose is not new. A history of non-drug headache and migraine therapy, brain has been tested, and they were mostly based on contemporaneous pathophysiological models that were used not only for headaches but also a variety of other ailments. Number 3. Run a warm, sweet bath. This weird methodology is at number 3 on our bizarre and weird headache treatment list. Moses Maimonides was a physician and astronomer from Cordoba in the 12th century. People came to Maimonides complaining of headaches, even back then because headaches have been around since the beginning of time. His treatment was unusual, but it didn't entail dead moles or worse, soak in a bath of warm, sweetened water. Honey was ideal, which draws away from the vapors that causes headaches. To be honest, that's not bad advice. Many individuals, perhaps feeling foggy in the mind after a a long day will draw a bath and soak in it for many hours. If you have a headache after viewing these weird cures, why not use that trick? Look like it works. Number 2. Put a dead mole on it. Praise be to Ali ibn Isa al-Kahai, the oculist. 
who by his labor medical advancement by hundreds of years. Ibn Isa was the first physician to uncover the symptoms that victims of void Koyanagi Harada syndrome, an eye condition, would display on a regular basis in the 10th century. And while he was a wise man ahead of his time, in many respects, the lack of confidence in medicine at the time meant that Ibn Isa was occasionally off the mark. It was for this reason that he could declare straight out of the best method to stop the pain was to lash a dead mole to your skull. The problem solved. Number 1. Burn your head. Yes, you heard that right. Burn your head. Naturally, if your brain feels like it's about to explode from your skull, you should add additional fire. Aratius of Cappadocia, an ancient Greek physician, advised this. Aratius makes the amusing observation that his proposals could well be hazardous treatments. Shave off the hair, which is excellent for the head on its own, and cauterize burn the muscles superficially. If you want to cauterize all the way down to the bone, do it where there is no muscles. Because if you burn your muscles, you will get cramps. Some doctors shave the hairline on the forehead all the way down to the bone. They abrade or chisel the bone down to the diplo. Then leave the flesh to develop over it. Others pierce the bone all the way to the meningus. These are potentially dangerous therapies. You must use them if the headache continues after all the measures have been taken. The patient maintains his or her bravery, and the body is active. These were the weird treatments for headaches. Tell us in the comments which one of the mentioned treatments would you like to be treated. Thanks for watching.